pedestrian bridges are provided by government in major cities across Nigeria to enable pedestrians cross from one side of a busy road to the other as a safety measure against being knocked over by fast-moving cars. Various locations in Lagos State boast of this all-important infrastructure, which in some cases are adorned with roofs. Because this infrastructure is provided with taxpayers' money and are sometimes constructed due to popular demand, the Lagos State government is strict about the use of pedestrian bridges. However, there are some pedestrian bridges in Lagos that serve as mere decorations on the highway and not for the particular purpose they were constructed. Idumata, a community with heavy human and vehicular traffic, has a pedestrian bridge of very long standing, but no one can remember the last time any pedestrian was seen on the bridge. Although the relocation of the bus stops away from the bridge is one of the reasons pedestrians say they no longer use the bridge, they prefer to risk their lives crossing the roads for security reasons. If the pedestrian bridge at Idumata requires urgent attention, the site of this pedestrian bridge at the Olosha axis of Agege Motor Road leaves nothing to the imagination. According to residents in the area, the bridge was constructed over 30 years ago. To describe the bridge as a death trap, they say, is an understatement. This resident had been living in the area for over 40 years. The Moshiaxis of Agege Motor Road also has a pedestrian bridge which has been abandoned by pedestrians for years. In view of deaths resulting from pedestrians crossing the highways instead of using the bridges they say are death traps, Lagos residents are appealing for the rehabilitation of all dilapidated pedestrian bridges in the metropolis and to address all the issues raised by respondents in this report.